I started this score, I had two things in mind. Uh, the first was that I wanted to benefit the movie. I wanted it to seamlessly enter into this universe and become the perfect coloring on this palette. Uh, I wanted it to blend, I wanted it to serve the story, the characters, the location. And the other goal I had was that I wanted it to be authentic. I wanted it to be original and I wanted it to stand on its own. I knew where to start um, based on some references that I had and some conversations that I had with the team. But I was also kind of just as much walking blind, um, not really sure where to start. I just started making things and trying things out little by little and sort of learning how to trust myself in this process and understanding where not only I was headed, but where the sound was headed, where the style was headed, and what exactly was going to be the thing that stitched all of these pieces together, what was going to be kind of the character of every track, what was going to be the nuances, the, the sound, the flavor that the score was going to be. And I, I'm still figuring it out every day. And, and the thing is, is that there's a lot of different, uh, every time I sit down to write, there's a lot of different options for how to start a song. It, it changes every single time. Um, and then doing something like this, where you're not only serving somebody else's vision, but you're also trying to mesh and blend with this whole other living, breathing thing, uh, it can be a little tricky and you don't want to rely on the same things too much but you also don't want to make everything so drastically different that it feels like you're getting musical whiplash um there's been there's a bit of a funk retro style that we're aiming for on the score and that's been a lot of fun just to mess around with and explore tap into um some of my funk heroes like the chili peppers um George Clinton, Earth, Wind, and Fire, and just find, you know, find real inspiration from the 70s and the 60s and a lot of these funk heroes that were around back in the day. And coming, coming up with an idea every time is not easy. There's a lot of coming back and forth to the drawing board and a lot of trial and error, a lot of just staring at a blank screen and a lot of spending an hour on something and deleting it immediately. I try not to do that often. Uh, yeah, my process, my process is always changing and I'm always changing with it. So it's hard to have any real grasp on where I am at any given point only because I feel like the music that I make changes as much as I do and that can be radically different based on any given day but I feel really positive about this score and I feel really positive about the direction it's going and I hope you like this video uh, I hope you like this new format and stay tuned for uh, another video pretty soon uh, thank you very much see you next time <laughs>